So over here in Adobe Spark, what you can do is add in text animations. So in order to add in text animation, I'm just going to bring in uh, this, let's say a template right here. So let me just bring that in. So once I do that, it's easy to add in text animation. So to add in the animation right here, you go on to the animation section, just like this. And then over here on the top, you got text animations. So you simply click on this and let's see what uh, you have right here. So there's the typewriter animation right there. And what that does is it lets you typewrite things right here. There's a dynamic type of animation right here, which pops up like this. And there's flicker type of animation right here. And then you got this hello cooler type of animation right here. And then you got this as well. Besides the text animation, you can also go around into other options like color shuffle animations right here, just like that. And all the colors shuffle out. You can also go around here, choose this one out right here. It shuffles the colors. And then you have the grow animation right here. So depending on the type of animation you want, you can make your uh, animation much more dynamic. You can also use the zoom option which uh, back, uh, zooms the background. And this one is more of uh, photo animation. So here there's text animation, photo animation. As of now, you cannot apply both of them at once. So you can see right here, you can pan it around and the background pans out. So let's just add in another picture for this one to make it more clear. So let's just replace this out. I'm going to find free photos right here. I'm just going to say computer just like this and then find out something like this. All right. So the background has been replaced just like that. Now, if I were to go over here onto animations, what happens is that I can zoom this around. You got the zoom animation. You got the pan animation. You got gray out animation, gray to color. And then you got blur animation right here. You got color. You can change it out. You can see that you can add in the effect of color animations right here. They are the suggested colors. And you got the fade animation right here. And that is how you can apply text and photo animation inside of your uh, Spark Post projects. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.